Happy today, the Labor Day travel chaos will hit its peak. Whether you're driving or flying, expect traffic jams on the road and long lines at the airport. If you plan on driving, AAA says the worst time to leave is between 2 and 6. And if you're headed to the airport, you may want to leave a little early today. WCNC Charlotte's Richard Devane joins us from Charlotte Douglas, where things are already picking up. How are they looking right now, Richard? <laughs> things are just as you said, things are picking up. We see some folks on we're on the uh, sky bridge as folks head toward the terminal. You can uh, well expect this to be the case today. Good morning to you. Good Friday morning. We're going to show you a look at the TSA lines from out, out of doors. Those lines are quite large. You can see there they're uh, larger than they were yesterday. Today is going to be a very busy day of travel. As we look at video, we can tell you the, the uh, AAA says that this is probably going to be a very busy Labor Day weekend. Uh, that doesn't matter matter whether you're heading out to the beach for your last summer vacation or if you're going to fly someplace or maybe get in your car and drive more than 50 miles away from home. Gas prices are down this year, so a lot of people will be taken to the road. A lot of folks at the airports, a lot of folks traveling, but we actually spoke to some people who say they're going to spend this Labor Day staying put. Here's what they had to say. Well, I'm going to stay home and hang around the lake and enjoy myself all weekend. Um, I'm going to stay in town actually for Labor Day and study. Uh, the traffic's pretty bad every day anyway, so I'm not trying to get out there and get stuck in that. Uh, anytime, anytime day or night, I try to stay off of 77, particularly Labor Day weekend. Yeah, I, I can agree with that. Staying off of 77 can always give you headaches. And if you don't want to have headaches at the airport, as you guys have said, usually they ask you to give yourself a couple hours before you get here if you're traveling uh, domestically, three hours if you're traveling internationally. But it's best as the day progresses because these lines are going to pick up. They're getting long now. Give yourself even more time, more than that. I was going to talk about travel times when you get behind the wheel, but you've said that a couple times. You know, the best, worst times to drive. Have a happy and safe Labor Day. Send it back to you.